Welcome back to our channel, Smiley vs. Sushrik. And we are wishing you all a Happy Sankranti! So today we are going to be vlogging everything we do today. From uh, Rangoli Mugus to flying kites. So yeah. let's begin. Guys, starting off with our Sankranti Mugu. Sankranti um, Mugu. Sankranti Rangoli. And over here it says... Sankranti Shubhakanchalu, which just means um, sank, ha, like wishing you guys a happy Sankranti. And over here we just have some plain design, which is also very pretty. Kite. Just, we can fly kite. Yep, here is a little kite design. Over there too. Here is the overall design yeah. of our Sankranti Rangoli of today. By the way, guys, so if we reach 1,000 subscribers, we might do our house tour. Okay, guys, now we're going to show our some crafty kites. So the first one is the, the one which I picked out, which is Little Sinkum, which means Little Tiger. So here it is. It's a very big kite. Yeah, it's a very big one. And it's not really made of paper. It's like made of um, covers. Or plastic. Like plastic. So something like that. On to the next one. To the next one, which my sister picked out. This one I picked out. Yeah. It's very pretty. Yes. With a yellow little, I mean, sorry, purple tail. Yellow kite. Pink dots and uh, blue triangles. Next kite. The next kite is, which I picked out again, this one. It's a very pretty yellow and pink kite with, with green, green something. Now the last kite, which my sixth sister picked out is this one, Augie and the Cockroaches. It was the only good design I found. <laughs> yeah. So he got two kites, I got two kites. So it's practically my sister got two kites and I got two kites. And tell the story how we lost one kite. Yeah, we lost one kite because we were, one fine day, we were just flying a blue kite, which was mine, and then when we were flying that blue kite, that blue kite just fell down, like got stuck, struck in the tree, and then just fell down nowhere. And oh. now we can't find it. Now we can't find it. We had five, now we have four. Yeah. So, sadly, we lost one. Yep. Okay, guys, now I'm going to be showing you how to make a um, Sankranti craft, which is some Sankranti clay. And this uh, is a very fun thing to do at home. You can, and if you don't like to touch like the badamas used to, like the things that are used to make badamas, you can make your own um, with some few ingredients and you'll be done. And you don't have to touch all that yucky stuff, but which is amazing so the ingredients you're going to be needing is some rice ara which is rice flour and some rangoli that you use for rangoli mugu and it's uh it's optional which color you want to use and the rice flour you like how much ever you want to make the clay that's how much you have to use so let's begin the first thing you're Okay guys, the first thing you need to do is um, take some rice flour, just like I have, and you need to grab how much ever rangoli you want. Just sprinkle it. Sprinkle, sprinkle, sprinkle. And really mix it until it all combines. Grab some more if you want to. Um, combine the ingredients very well. So 
So you can make more than one uh, rangoli color in here. You can add more than one, but I'm just going to stick with one. So right now, as you can see, it's really like a really light color, but once we add the water, it can be a little bit darker. So I'm going to take one teaspoon and just sprinkle it on top like this. Ooh, look at all these bubbles. Just mix it in thoroughly until you get a really nice clay dough type of texture. Just combine it. And you can also use your hands, but just for now, I'm just going to pour in the water and I'm go we have to mix with our hands. Just drop in the water. See, as you can see now, it's getting darker and darker. Just keep it going. Just a little bit more and use your hands to mix. And your clay dough will be ready. And uh, this type of clay will not rot because you added rangoli in it and the rice floor. So this type of clay does not rot. And it won't get any fungi or anything like that. Okay. I guess we can add just a little bit more. Sprinkle. Remember, when you're adding the water, just add a little bit at a time, or else if you add too much and your um, clay is like a paste, just add more flour. The more wetter it is, just add a little bit of flour, and if it's too hard, just add a bit more water. Mine is combining really well. Wow, look at this. Here's the fi final result. It is a very soft, nice clay. You just have to knead it after you made the dough and it's all ready to go. And here is a really satisfying trick. Oh yeah. And it's easy clean, like you can easily clean it up if it sticks to the ground or something. Just pick it up and it'll stick to itself. It's mess free. Okay guys, for the next craft, um, Zishik is going to show us how to make a paper kite. It's amazing. It's like your own kite, which is amazing. And Lixia's done. Okay guys, now I'm going to show you how to make your own newspaper kite. So guys, the material you're going to need for the newspaper kite is a newspaper, like a big one, some tape, at least four cheaper cutters or cheaper sticks, copper cheaper sticks, like that. You can use four and some scissors. So let's begin. Okay guys, now you have this big newspaper, right? Now we're gonna have to cut it in the middle on this one and on this one. Okay guys, now this is my paper, so you're going to cut it from this big newspaper right here. So, one, so guys, once you have cut the newspaper, the next step is to make the square. Make a square. And you just have to fold it like this. So the top, the top um, side to the left side. So like that. And 
then we can cut it on over here. Guys, 
this is how to make the kite. For the last and final step, you're going to have a parent to help you out to make where to make the holes and um, how to put the thread on. So you're going to request the parent on how to do that. So after you've done that, then your kite is ready. So this kite is going to fly really how you wanted a kite. This is really amazing. So if you guys like this video, please, 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 please make thumbs up and subscribe to our channel, Smiley vs. Fish. And comment down below which part of our video that you like the best. And share this video with your friends and turn on the notification bell no, so, so you, you get, get notified. notified every single time we post a new video. Goodbye! Yeah.